And welcome back to Dead Space, everybody. When we last left off, we were transporting our marker to its holy resting place, the pedestal. And uh, basically lighting everything on fire that gets in our way. And so far, it's been a pretty good time. Uh, although we did die in the last episode, thanks to me uh, being useless. But that happens. Okay, hey, we actually got some force energy there. We haven't had that for a little while, have we? Nice. So, ooh. Nice, not bad, not bad. Ooh. All right, let's get rid of you to start off with. Oh, hello. You know what? Let's use the force gun. Whilst we got it. And I am not enjoying all these stutters. They seem to have got worse towards the end of the game. Hmm. It's kind of difficult to recommend the PC version of this game, sadly. But, you know, it is what it is, I guess. So, we've got some... Alright. Who's making all that noise? Somebody upstairs is being a little bit melodramatic. So let's go see if we can sort his problem out. Hello. Come at me, fools. Let's use a bit of that. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of cool, I guess. I guess it just kind of sticks everyone together. Which is probably very good for crowd control. But, you know. Limited use at the moment. Oh, hello. Let's see you there, dude. Let's see if we can't sort your problem out. A better dude? Yeah. Can I take your, um, whatever that is, and hit your mate with it? Oh, that was your face. Oh. Smash some skulls with our skull. Yeah, I'm still not 100% sure what these things do. I'm guessing they attack you if you get, like, stupidly close to them. But apart from that, not 100 percent sure. Anywho, we've got some stuff. We like stuff. I was going to say, and a nothing. Now, we don't like getting nothing, that's for sure. Anyone got something to say about that? Anybody at all? Yes, there's always one. Ooh, you don't look so good there, fella. Ah, I thought you were one of them. Run, Isaac. Quite surprised we was doing the damage we were doing to him, actually. I thought the second you hit those guys, they kind of just fall apart. I guess I've learned something here today, kids. Okay. Certainly under the marker's influence here. And we ain't feeling alright, that's for sure. Okay. Cash. And more cash. Oh, well, cash is always good. Whoop. Now, have we solved that little issue? Alright, smooth sailing for now.
this marker certainly doesn't move at much of a sprightly pace, does it? Almost as if uh, the game wants to slow this part down. Are we good? Are we good? Seriously? Ah, right, hang on. Keep the boop. Open the shutter. There we go. We've got a claw and we're not afraid to use it. Definitely not afraid to use this bad boy. Hey! Ooh! A save station and loads of supplies. Well, be rude not to. Plasma energy though. God damn. Oh, a new boot as well. Probably don't need to wear the boot. Okay. Let's grab us a claw. And continue onwards. Ooh, here we are. To the marker's final resting place. Technically didn't want to fire that off. Oh, hi. Ow. Yep. Quite enough of that. Mies thinks. So, we don't actually... have any more uh, ammo or any more health kits noted there's that one right what have we got we've got some more bastard zombies space zombies more dangerous than the regular kind of zombies. One would assume. Okay, those guys actually paid up quite nicely. We like that. Now. If I was another pulsating pus sack. Where would I be hiding? Hmm. So we've got one over there. I'm guessing it's got to be one under... Ah, hello. Yep. I remembered. Honestly, I did. Right, that's you done. And let's hold those guys there. Nothing coming from that side. Good. At least nothing coming from that side yet. Anyway, this is where we turn around and there's a whole bloody armada coming towards us. Nope, we're good. As long as we can funnel them into one little kill zone, we're good. Lovely. Liberal use of fire. Fire solves all of life's problems. Yep, we're good. Ooh, some med kits. Don't mind that. Okay. Alright. Well, this place looks like absolute hell on earth, doesn't it? Who scribbled all this shit everywhere? Honestly. Not a fan of what they did with the place. Come yeah, on. There we go. I'm making us whole, don't worry. It's all under control. Oh, here come the deadites. Yeah, this could be rough. Oh god, okay. Containment has been breached. That's fine. 
plenty in the tank. Plenty in the tank. Text log. We'll have a look at that in a minute. Any goodies for us? Look at this hellscape, though. What a planet to be stuck on. Without any way off. Just completely overrun by these monstrous, mutated space zombies. So, Dr. G. Abernathy. Aegis 7 Clinic. Automated transcript. Dr. Abernathy. I've quarantined the uh, former Dr. Clifton and Hogan. We're barricaded in, and I intend to keep a complete log no matter what happens out there. Different vectors of infection seem to be. Somebody needs to keep a record. If the marker signals can change a body from a distance, we need to know. Update. The chest of Dr. Clifton's corpse has started to expand, like uh, it's taking a deep breath. Something appears to be happening under the surface of the skin. The body's convulsing. There's a yellowish, briny liquid bursting from the mouth. He's choking, but he's all... God, I hope it's not it's gas release. Update. Okay, now there's uh the effigus is effigus is bulging out and the uh, jaw is collapsing. Escophagus, I should say. Dyslexia. Uh jaw is collapsing. The head is uh head is splitting apart. It's reforming. Almost like it's a pro Probosis with feelers? That's interesting. The chest is splitting along the center now. The chest is splitting and it's uh, stretching, expanding outwards as the uh, internal organs, muscle and bone are bent inwards. Can I get a scanner, please? No, no, the scanner. Thank you. So the um, internal organs have reorganized themselves. It's The structure isn't... Uh, there seems to be a central organ now resembling a massive bladder. The bladder is filling with a liquid, some of which can be seen spilling from his uh, the creature's proboscis. So the two must be connected. Update. The legs are quivering violently. The flesh is peeling away and uh, merging with the flesh from the chest re fuck sorry shit the um the leg just bent backwards and uh okay now the other one just snapped back at the knee as well it's uh starting to sit up that's it seems fully reanimated can we hello yeah p sec anybody who's free to euthanize god i have to think of everything update the uh splatter on the glass is making observations difficult. I miss that Dr. Hogan is also transforming, but I know not that his legs are elongating, somehow flaying themselves, and they're twisting uh, with a mixture of his own internal organs into a single appendage. It's like some sort of tail. His face is contorting, his jaw is clenching and unclenching. It's, it's crunching in on itself, and Shit, several uh, jaw-like appendages are emerging from his mouth. But it can't uh, accommodate the... Oh, shit, his head is splitting open too. Like Clifton's. I can't... Sounds of vomiting. Update. Oh, fuck, he's circling the room. It's not like Clifton. It's like he's hunting? Does he see me? No, the vents. He's going for the vents. P-Sec, P-Sec, is anybody left? Sounds of impacts. Screaming and organ crunching noises. Yeah, that's actually one of my favorite logs in the game. And also, pretty horrific. I'm a fan. Anywho, let's get out of here. Oh, hi. Not on my watch, Sunny Jim. There we go. Not on my watch. Loader offline, of course it is. And we can't get in there yet. Okay. Let's start moving this bass. Whoa. And again with the frame lags. 
Oh, hey. Hello. I don't think so. Not today, you worm. Oh, sounds like they're coming from behind, too. That's fine. Let's go back ourselves into a corner. Let's put up a defensive line. And flame on. There we go. Lovely. Oh, more coming. That's okay. Hold that line. Hold the line. Ooh, breacher. We got a breacher. I'm trying. I'm trying. Okay. Another wave dealt with. Jeez. That was intense. Right, anyway, on you go. I don't like the look of that. That's bad. That's really bad. Yeah, we're getting out of here. Also, our flamethrower is almost empty. Which is not great. Ooh, hello. Isaac. There's no fixing this. Let her go, Daniels. Let who go? Can't you see how delusional you are? We've got to go. The payload from the planet crack is about to fall. I gave you a chance to come around, Isaac. But if you still won't see it, I'll help you. One last time. Wrigley override. This time, watch to the end. Isaac, it's me. Oh, I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I just wish I could talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. Strange. Such a little thing. Just had a talk. That's all this research was in the end. Not much, is it? Just trying to make it listen when he begged for convergence. But I had a different prayer. It spoke. And then it listened. Make this stop, I said. Maybe it understood.
for her and Nicole for you. Okay. Now, I can't remember if that's how it happened in the original. Uh, was, Nicole, was Nicole just um, a hallucination? Or was it actually um, the other scientist? Because if that's new, if they've changed it, so uh, you were just projecting Nicole onto this other person and they were doing the same to you, that's brilliant. I really like that. But I can't remember in the first game. Anywho. I don't know how Kendra is not being affected to the same degree. It's kind of odd. She's being affected, sure, but not to the same degree. We can still make it. But let's just gather up all these goodies first. For science. And can't leave here without all this money. Nice. Lovely. One. Ooh, big med kit. Don't mind if we do. Oh boy. Yeah, this is how we uh, <laughs> get back. Nice. Flame for a fuel. More flame for a fuel. Not sure how useful the flame for is actually going to be here, but whatever. We shall find out. So, yes, Isaac, Nicole is dead. But pretty sure deep down you already knew that, didn't you? Um. I guess we could try the contact beam out. I guess we could. Oh boy, and here we are. Let's go. Now, let's just continue with the Ripper. Uh, let's go down here. Durability seems like a, or duration I should say, seems like it would be a useful thing. And there we go. Okay. And to the shop. So this is it. This is it. Now I've got the large med kit. Let's check, see what we've got. So we've got not a lot of inventory space. Let's. Did we drop a save? I can't remember. Go okay, drop a save. Just in case we kind of screw things up. Which is absolutely possible, by the way. Now, hmm, see this restores a large amount of health. It doesn't say how much is a large amount of health. Let's move that to storage. The flamethrower I don't think is going to be super effective here. But I might be wrong. 
I think what we're going to want is med kits. Okay, for th let's just get th four of those. Um, it's expensive, of course, but all the best things in life are. All right. There's nothing we can do here. Oh, what? Did we just get crushed by the door? I think we did. Right, let's get our ass to the shuttle. Oh. Now you want our help. How about go fuck yourself? Yeah, this is gonna get bad. Oh man. Right, let's go to work. I guess we're going to use oof, everything at our disposal. Oh, God. Reach the landing pad. Well, we're trying. Oh, cheers. Really? It's just giving me all of these stasis packs. Now, I never actually tried using the stasis packs on this thing. So I don't know how uh, effective they are, to be honest. Come on. There we go. Let's just do this nice and slowly now. You and your bloody Blobby breath. Oh, God. Right, there we go. Uh, come on. Ow. Alright. How would you like that? God damn it. <laughs> this is giving us all this shit. Alright. Oh, hello. Yeah, no. Not today. Definitely not today, guys. Not having any of that. Keep coming and I'm going to keep killing. We can do this all day. And I'm sure we're going to be rapidly running out of ammo here. Okay, how's it going now? Ooh. You're getting angry. Slapping us with his tentacles. There we go. Yeah, he doesn't like that. Doesn't like that at all. Oh, lovely. But then we're not exactly fond of the acid attack. Ow. Oh. Ow. That's okay. Just keep. Keep dancing. Just keep dancing. Another one of your balls destroyed. Oof. Okay. Okay. 
Damn you and your bloody acid. You're cutting off half the map. You're cheating. Cheating bastard. That's fine. Very difficult to avoid these tentacles in this situation. Oof, God. Okay. Okay. Got ya. Can we get that out of the way, please? Oh, God. That's really the wrong side of heaven right there. That's okay. Literally cutting off half the map. Actually, not quite. That was a pretty good cycle. Come on, you big overgrown penis. Let's do this. Let's see those big old balls of yours. Come on. Oh, there we go. I thought I was in trouble again. But nope, we're good. Ready for another cycle? Yes, I thought you would be. Whoa, God. Just get away from that stuff. That's alright, Isaac. That's alright. Oh, man. As long as it doesn't get in your mouth, you're okay. I'm sure. Ugh. Icky. Icky, icky, icky. That's fine. Come on. We're just going to stand here and dance with you. Dancing here in the moonlight. Okay. Any more? That's all you got, huh? That's all you got. Now this could be bad. Oh dear. This could be very bad. But luckily, we got the skills to get the kills. Oof. Okay. Job done. And yeah, it's 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 just gone. Wow. And we still have so much ammo for that gun. Like that barely took anything. That really barely used any of our resources at all. How interesting. Okay. That was way easier than I kind of remember. Uh, what do we want? Can we actually drop anything? Uh, I mean, those are two grand each, and those sell for not even two grand, so... Yeah, I guess... I guess we're going to have to leave all of those behind. What a shame. Alright, well, whatever. Or can we go... Oh, flame for a fuel. Yeah, I guess we can't go back to a shop to just bundle those last things into our inventory. What a bastard. This weapon is very efficient. A hey, trusted contractor and why is it paused? Resume. Yes. 
Shimura really was a great ship. Yeah. We were lucky to see her in her prime. Are we going home, Isaac? There's so much work to do. Soon. I promise. Gotta build a little something first. For me? What is it? It's a surprise, sweetie. Huh. Okay. <laughs> that was actually quite different. Um so the secret ending is Isaac going full psycho and fully committing to the um marker, I guess. That was sweet. Whereas the actual um normal ending, which I will have on the end of this video by the way. Uh, the actual normal ending is just the, uh, very similar to the original. Huh. <laughs> anyway, guys, that's Dead Space uh, on hard difficulty with the secret ending. Um, I enjoyed that. I, like, really, really enjoyed that. This has been one of the most fun and enjoyable games um, for a long, long time. And it does prove that Dead Space really can still hang with the big boys. And I need to turn my headset down. What a game. And to be fair, it's... So, although, yes, okay, it does have a few quality of life upgrades and visually is has had quite a big overhaul. It's still the same basic game. And it holds up that well. If you're not interested in buying this HD remaster and you decide to replay the original Dead Space again, you're still going to be playing a fantastic game. What an absolute victory for the development, though. Um, the only negative I have are the PC performance, but I guess we just have to, you know, get used to that these days. PC ports are just not at the standard uh, where they should be. Not even close. I mean, I'm not even just talking visual effects. I mean, actual performance of the game. That was my big criticism. The weapons in this game are absolutely a joy to play with. Uh, the enemies as well. Although the enemies, there isn't like a huge variety of enemies. It just never really... For me personally, they just don't get old fighting them. They're always fun. Um, I'm going to look forward to trying the other weapons. Definitely. I'm probably going to... I, I don't know. I was going to say I'm probably going to play this again one more time before I go for the hard mode run. But I might just go straight into the hard mode run uh, when I've got a bit of time. Now... I'm just going to record it. I'm not going to I'm not going to do any uh, voice commentary with it. I'm just going to record it when I when I do actually do it. Uh and I won't upload it <laughs> until until it's done. Because I don't want to upload something where we die like, you know, almost pretty much straight away. I'm not really sure how I'm going to handle it, but it's it's, you know, we've got Resident Evil Four to get through, uh, and by the time this video is uploading, Resident Evil 4 is already out. Obviously, Resident Evil 4 is not out yet um, at the time of recording. Now, the audio work as well. Uh, I don't think they've really done a lot of audio work to this game. Obviously, it's uh, you know been remastered and whatnot, and they've probably had the um, it's probably been remixed for newer standards of um, surround sound, but it's still the same sort of basic ambience. It was fantastic. I love the way they rewrit the two main characters as well. Or should I say all the characters? They feel way more natural than they did in the original game. So much more natural. 
Uh, they, I mean, they were bickering and stuff and, you know, arguing, but it just felt a little bit forced in the original. The new character models as well, in my opinion, are so much better than the original. I mean, Kendra, to me, always stuck out like a sore thumb. Uh, definitely on the begin uh, in the beginning, uh, when you're actually approaching the Ishimura and she's giving you that bit of a speech. Because she's just got this stupid little anime... She looks like an anime doll. And she really contrasts badly against everybody else in the game, to me. These huge, massive, like, anime knockers that just don't make any sense either. So she looks way more natural and more realistic in this game. I think all the characters do as well. They, they just seem to have a little bit more artistic consistency. And that's basically my thoughts on this remake. Absolutely superb. What a surprise and what an absolute joy. So, that ends this LP. I guess if there's any more from this LP to come, it will be... Hey, we've got 50,000 credits and 10 power nodes reward, uh, awarded. Yeah, so if we see any more videos, it will be me doing the uh, impossible run. But only if, obviously, the impossible run goes ahead. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. So, thanks so much, guys, and as always, till next time. I could talk to you. I'm sorry.